You've got blood on these days. What is our Inhibitor container detected.
You guys seen this? What's his deal? seen my kids in months because of this ridiculous blockade in the center. He can't be serious. <laughs> 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 Night runners are real. <clears throat> Just fairy tales, if you ask me.
they took all the equipment. Don't make it laugh. Maybe there's a way to fix it. Back yesterday, but the merchant's late. Sorry to hear that. Five years ago, everything would have been simpler. Why'd you say that? This is madness, Sophie. The peacekeepers have more weapons. Men. They will crush us like worms. Ator may have more men, but we have the home field advantage. Home field advantage? You're crazy. I forbid it. While I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar, not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this, or leave. Roger, Humphrey, arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar. Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You want to be like your mother? You'll have blood on your hands, Sophie. A lot of blood. Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie? What the? Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Ador can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Ador is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. And fast, before Ador gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory. Provide weapons to anyone capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Okay. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will win. This new armor of yours is flimsy. More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Fierstein! Beetle shells are great protection! This is top craftsmanship made from the finest quality materials. Built from. Ah! Ah! Uh oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out! <laughs> He's gonna blow! <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter, and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Nah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests! No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. <laughs> but first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hmm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, the past chemical fallout and to, uh, uh, What's it called? A central loop? 
The central loop, right! How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So, you win? Okay, so the windmill powers all the PK's UV lamps? Yes, it does indeed. A lot of people will die. Only if the PK don't turn tail and head back to where they belong. They stole that windmill from us. It was ours. Lucas and his men, they... When they came, they... Ah! Ah! Damn it! Took, took it. it. Exactly. They took it. Without electricity, Aethor can't keep anyone here. We have generators, smaller power sources. They need a large power source. They'll have to withdraw. And before they return with backup from the central loop, we'll block the tunnel ourselves. Their commander, Jack Matt, is not going to risk fighting in the dark with the infected and renegades at his back. Old Villador will be ours again, and you will go to the center. All right, fine. I'll do it. Okay, go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joel tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. What are you waiting for? <clears throat> Sometimes I wake up at night and forget the fall even happened. That's about the only time I smile. here PKs they've been searching us for weapons found our Molotovs and went ape shit slaughtering everyone in sight looks like someone set us up who and where are the bombs for Alberto we managed to send some out the couriers last reported near Star Square then silence Alberto the charges are gone I'm going to the Star Square that was their last check-in. Oh. Oh, my. Exactly. Aiden. Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the charges. Without them, the 
plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. The PKs ambushed your transport. He searched everyone and everything. Eventually, they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly, something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um, they were in the yard. Come on, maybe they didn't steal all of them. Lucky few, the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs> Fucking up.
Yeah. 